Good morning, everyone. It's time for What's Trending. I'm going to go over the most viral topics and stories on our website, northwestohio.com, and pull in some of your viewer comments from our WNWO Facebook page. So we'll get into it, starting with our Facebook page, a very controversial topic about whether or not you should legalize medical marijuana. And we got into this because a Miami billboard, it's targeting seniors, as you can see, says legalize medical marijuana. I'm a patient, not a criminal. So we wanted to know what you think, and we pulled some comments. This first one, if I can get it up here, is from Jerry Lynn. It says, if it gets legalized, legalize it for everyone, not just medical, because people will sell and share it anyway, and even steal it. Maybe if it gets legalized, it will cut down or stop the harder street drugs. So that's one perspective from Jerry. And then over from Lisa, she says, well, there are no additive ingredients in marijuana, like in cigarettes, which have chemicals to make you get addicted, or alcohol, which is like poison. I say if you're going to sell tobacco and alcohol, why bother make marijuana illegal? I say legalize it, a non-pot smoker's opinion. So thanks, Lisa, for your comment. And lastly, we'll get into Dave Mock. He says, I see no need for it. If they're talking end-of-life issues, we already have, a, have hospice to help with that. And we want to know what you think. Head over to Facebook.com slash Northwest Ohio. And then we're going to get into a very popular trending topic on our website. This past month, there's been three wrong way crashes here in Northwest Ohio. And this last Friday, there was a memorial service for three students who were killed in the crash. And that's getting a lot of traction on our website. So we went ahead and talked to the Wood County Sheriff to see how they and ODOT are combining forces and some of the problems that they're having in dealing with wrong way driving. It, it's, it's a cost issue. It depends on how much money, you know, again, uh, how much money do we put into this. Certainly, lives are worth a lot of money, uh, we, we, but, but there are a lot of other things that save lives that cost a lot of money, too. So it's, it's going to be a tough decision for ODAT on how they wish to, uh, to deal with that. All right, so then, of course, we wanted to see what the viewers thought and some of your solutions for how we can deal with wrong way driving here in Northwest Ohio. And we've pulled two comments for you here. Terry Lee says, they should have sensors put in the poles to where you get on the off-ramp or when you're getting off the off-ramp. There should be an alert system at the highway patrol post. Then they know what mile marker to determine the location of the wrong way driver. So that's one of the solutions that they're considering. And then also Ed Austin says, has anyone ever considered the possibility of painting directional arrows on the lane divider lines on limited access highways? And so he goes on to say it would be a very inexpensive way to just paint some arrows so that way impaired or wrong way drivers would see that they're going the wrong way. He thinks it would be a very inexpensive solution for ODOT. But of course, if you have a better solution, head over to facebook.com slash Northwest Ohio. And that's it for me, but you can always keep on top of our What's Trending topics over on northwestohio.com.